Okay, let's talk about Roll20 token marker sets. Okay, so what is a token marker set? It is a set of icons, images, emojis um, that is used to mark a token. What is a token? A token in Roll20 is a miniature. So to give you an example, uh, here are some tokens uh, in play, and you can see that they have been marked. So this wolf creature is uh, dodging, right? Uh, this guy right here is below half health, so he is bloodied. This guy right here is concentrating. Uh, over here, you can see that this Yed, or sorry, Etten, has um, been marked as orange, and the guy that he is grappling is marked as orange, so that we know this guy is grappled by that Etten. He's also bloodied too, which is you know worth noting. Very easy and cool way to keep track of what's happening in the game, and we access these by selecting a miniature selecting the arcade button, and then choosing whichever marker we want to use. Now, my markers look pretty cool. Um, there's even these adorable, like, uh, little emojis that you can, like, put on there. Um, and then you've got these weird black and white ones at the bottom. Yeah, these are the default ones that are provided with Roll20. Um, while they're certainly good enough to get by, um, they now have the feature that you can um, add custom ones. And that's what we're talking about. So, going back to the main page of your particular campaign, on the right-hand side, it's going to say Token Marker Sets. And with this interface, you can add and edit uh, token markers for your game. Where do we get token markers? Well, you go to the Marketplace on Roll20, and you search for token markers, and there will be like five pages of markers to choose from. Uh, every conceivable style you could imagine. You are bound to find something that you and your group like. Uh, they generally are 5 to $10. You buy it once, and it can be applied to as many of your games as you like. So, there you go. Let's assume that you went and got yourself a set, and continue the video. So, I have my own set. I want to add it. I'm going to go to Token Marker Sets. I'm going to hit Plus. I'm going to click here in this empty field and look for which set I want to use. I'm going to install these emoji ones, and then I'm going to hit the little blue button that says update. I don't want to hit create set, uh, because create set will take me to a different page and a different interface wherein I can create my own set of tokens, which is something that we're not going to cover in this video, but um, essentially you could make your own token markers based on the needs of your game and the general aesthetic of your game, that sort of thing. So. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and hit update. And now we have added uh, generic emote tokens. Cool. Um, and then I'm going to go ahead and add it again. And I'll add the ones that I made myself. There we go. Add them to the game. Now, if you wanted to, you could also get rid of um, a set by clicking the dot 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 here and then just removing it from the game. And you could also look at a set by going to View Token Marker Set, and it'll open up a page that'll show you all the different uh, markers that are in that set. All right, so now that I've installed them, let's log into the game and see what's going on. All right, so we're booting it up. We're in the Delian Tomb with our friends Cam and John. And let's see what's going on. If I select John and I go to this arcade button, I see now that all of those uh, new markers are there. So John goes into the room and he is mad, right? Cool. Um, but then the goblin shaman casts fear on him and he's scared. Uh, and then he gets a critical fumble and he's confused. And it just goes on and on and on. You just fill that thing up like a good old MMO. Uh, just fill it up with stuff. Uh, eventually, of course, they're too small to see. Um, but yeah, it's incredibly useful. So that is what token markers do. And that is how you add token markers to your game. Uh, perhaps in a future video, we'll cover how to make your own uh, token set. Uh, but for now, there's plenty of cool options out there. And I hope you find one that you like, and I hope that this video was helpful for you.